So you guys thought that I missed some of the other 5-star units here on ASTD? Come on, do not underestimate me. It's so cold What up, Snow Squad? It's your boy Snow, and yes, I am back, guys, here for another showcase video. Yeah, I'm really sorry, guys, but I really just had to take a break earlier because, you know, I was so exhausted waiting for the update to be dropped. And yeah, don't worry. I mean, I've already gotten like uh, those other, actually, I already have all of the five star and all of the other units, including the four star and three star units that we have. But it's just the fact that it's not really that easy to create a video for all of them. All right. So that's the reason why as well on this video, we will be doing a double showcase for this time. So I will be showcasing you guys Rengoku and also Sanemi or Sanemi. I'm really sorry Demon Slayer fans. I'm not really reading the manga and I just found out that some of the characters here, especially Akaza, uh, they're not really on the anime itself. So anyway guys, let's try to see what they can do on the infinite mode. Actually guys, I could have just uh, put like uh, Rengoku and also Akaza because it seems that they're like kind of like the arc enemy in the story but it just happened that I just didn't have like energy anymore so I'm really sorry about that guys. And yeah, I really wanted to say thank you for those who are also a little bit worried about my voice earlier. Actually, my voice is still bad right now, but you will be needing 450 cash guys to summon your Senemi. And uh, I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing his name wrong, by the way, because bro, oof. Okay, what is four seconds per attack, right? But why was it not enough? Okay, bro, for real. All right, so he will be attacking per four seconds. And I think that on his position right now, priority AOE would be best because he got like, look at that AOE cone. He is AOE, but his AOE cone is kind of like, um, who was that? Uh, Killua, yeah. I think that he got like the same Killua thing. And by the way, this character really looks like Toshiro, like one of the characters on my intro. Not gonna lie, his hair looks almost the same. Not the face though, but <laughs> yeah, I kind of imagine like Toshiro will be here soon. Oh, that'll be hype. So after 450 guys, you will be spending another 450 cash to get plus three range and a little bit of deduction on his SPA, but the damage will be only 25. So I think that he's not gonna be like a heavy burst damage dealer, but it's so early to judge him right now. So we will be needing another 500 cash, but let's just try to appreciate that animation though. Maybe the developers added a new animator here on ASTD because like all of the animation on those new units are clean, not gonna lie. All right, so 500, let's now do that. So at upgrade number two, guys, he will now be damaging 104 with SPA of 3.8 and his range is now 29 but the thing is that his aoe cone is not really impressive all right it's it's actually thin guys but of course it's not as thin as mihawks but you guys can already see it animation didn't change i think oh no actually it did yep it's gonna be kind of like a explosion thingy Oh yeah, the reason why he looks so familiar is because his character was also on Wisteria. He's kind of like the wind trainer if you wanted to get the wind breathing style. Oh, okay. All right, so anyway, let's now upgrade him to the next one. You will be needing 1,250 to get another five range plus 90 damage and a little bit of deduction again on his SPA. Let's now do it. Bam. All right, so he will now be damaging 194 with 3.6 SPA in total and his range will be 34, still going to be a semi AOE unit. By the way, guys, while we are waiting for some cash here, if you want me to rank all of those newest five star that we have gotten here, at least on the most recent update of ASTD, maybe you guys can give me like 1K likes if ever. There are like four five star units that were added here. So yeah, that's the reason why I'm pretty sure that you guys Especially for those who do not have a lot of gems, I'm sure that you guys might want to see first which one should you roll, but but yeah, I can do like a comparison for all of them so that you guys would also be informed. All right, I think that, oh, we still do not have enough cash. Oh, actually, yes, there you go. 1600 is what you need, guys, if you want to upgrade into upgrade number four, 
But look at that, plus seven damage, plus 160 damage, and another 0.2 second per attack deduction, and he would get Red Windy Blade. All right, so let's now grade it. Ooh, man. Look at the animation, guys. Yo, he just got like Red Nichiren. Yo, this looks so cool, especially that I'm playing Wisteria right now. Yo, look at that. Oh, okay. Bro, I swear, all of the new animation are so clean. I mean, I'm not saying that the animation from those previous five stars are actually bad, but it, these are just really like in the next level. So for the guy who actually created this animation, bro, if you're the same guy who made the animation from the five star, you were improving. Dang. That looks so cool. Look at that. Pretty dope. All right. So anyway, guys, anyway, guys, let's now try to max him 1750 cash for him to be maxed and you will get yet another 0.2 second per attack bro why don't you just give this guy like 3 spa at max he will be also getting 175 damage there you go so at full upgrade guys he will be damaging 529 per 3.2 seconds and his range will be 41 which is really decent it's kind of like uh, maybe a little bit of smaller version of Luffy-ish kind of AOE thingy and also his range because Luffy got like um, 50, right? Anyway guys, let's now go to my boy Rengoku. Not gonna lie, I really love the hair of this character though. Alright, so let's now try to... Oh, wait. Why is this? Oh, he's not gonna be AO... Oh yeah, his AOE was removed. Okay. All right, so at level one, guys, he will be damaging 75 per 6.6.5 seconds. Okay, but he is a single target unit. All right, his range is 51, which is not that bad, but oh, he will be doing some burn attack. Ah, yeah. So by the way, guys, for those who actually owned Rengoku, he is still subjected to a possible buff or nerf. All right. Because he got buffed, then he got nerfed. So I think that they are still trying to figure out which is which. But yeah, for now, this is the version of Rengoku that we have. So I'm going to showcase them to you. 500 cash, guys, for you to get additional 80 damage. Let's now do it. There we go. And his animation didn't change. But he looks so slow, though. 6.5 second per attack, bro. Why? pretty sure that this is one of the main characters like he's the i think that he's the owner of sun breathing style if i'm not mistaken but i'm still not on that part of the story yet <laughs> all right so 600 cash guys you will be getting 120 damage plus fire stream it's not a clickable skill and let's see oh wait a minute bro that animation looks like kilo a god speed like this one pretty sure all right so he now looks fast but his spa is still 6.5 all right so on his next upgrade you will be spending 800 cash and you will get an additional range of three plus 150 damage but then again guys even though his damage is now 425 his spa is only 6.5 and at the same time he's only damaging one so i'm not sure about his last two upgrades guys but so far he's not that good not gonna lie Earlier, he was doing burn damage, but... Ah, oh, bro. Okay, we will see it later, guys. Don't worry. All right, so anyway, let's now upgrade him. 1,000 cash, you will be getting 5 range, plus 200 damage, and plus Dragon's Dance. Okay, it's Dragon's with letter S. He will still be a single target unit. Bro. I really wanted to see if he would give, like, burning damage, but the HP of the mobs here at wave 11 is just really low, so he's just, like, one-clapping them. Oh my god, look at that animation, guys. Look, look, look. His animation changed, and that is gonna be... Ooh, that's clean. Bro, that is insane. Look at that. Yo, guys, I swear. I'm falling in love with the animation lately here. Like, all for all of those new characters, guys, the animation is sick. All right, so anyway, 1,450, let's not try to max him. He will be getting plus five range and plus 300 damage. So it seems, guys, that he will end up as a single target unit. Level one, guys, he will be damaging 925. 
But the thing is, yeah, he's only single target unit. And I think earlier he can do like burn damage, but I'm just not sure now because he's just like one clapping everything. So that's the reason why. I'm just gonna wait for stronger mobs guys so that we can also confirm if he is still doing a burning damage. But yeah, I'll be right back. It took me ages guys, but yep, it is confirmed that he is now still doing burning damage. And look at that. Bro, that means the 925 damage that you guys can see here, that will still be multiplied for around uh, maybe four to five ticks. Uh, I already forgot like how many ticks do we have for the burning damage. And if it's gonna be like the same as Natsu and also Ace, it's gonna be like super duper single target unit. That would be really insane damage though. Like, I think it's gonna be really good for story mode. If ever you got some Bulma, uh, like eight of them or maybe a couple of them would really melt any boss. Pretty sure like at level one, 925, pretty sure if you will upgrade him to at least level 20, he would be at 1000 plus with burning damage and that's really really good guys that is really really good so there you go guys that is the power of our demon slayer boys that's gonna be rengoku and also uh, sanami and again guys i'm really sorry if i'm not pronouncing their names correctly but yeah that would be their power and like what i said i might create a video probably comparing all of the newest five stars that we have but yeah on my next video guys i will be showcasing all of the new four stars that we have received on this new update i'm so tired guys so please bear with my voice and yeah please do not forget to leave a like and if you're not a subscriber yet come on what are you even doing smash that subscribe button we are trying to hit 100k and it will be really really special if you will be part of it so yeah that's gonna be pretty much it guys and i will upload another video in a couple so yeah see you in a bit and stay cold peace out